Welcome back guys to another episode of Hacks and Hunt. In today's video we are going to be shooting the Hoyt Axius Alpha at a short draw of 25 inches. We're going to throw it through the chronograph, see how fast it's shooting um, with a 437 grain arrow at 26, or sorry, 25 inch draw. So if you guys want to see how this bow performs at 25 inches, then go ahead and stay tuned. All right, so first up, we're just gonna go ahead and draw this bow and kind of focus in on the uh, string angle to see how that feels at 25 inches. That's about five inches short for me, so it is it is very short, um, but it is a short axle axle bow, being at 29 and a half inches axle to axle. Um, and so you're gonna get a better string angle at 25 inches than having at 30. So that's why I like to kind of show what it looks like. So this is at 70 pounds. And 25 inches so if I just anchor in here like I would regularly it feels like it feels like the ultra at 30 inches um, that string angle is very wide with just a 25 inch um, draw weight or draw length Let's do that again and it's a very smooth draw it's hard to get it smooth into that back wall with it being so short for me. I kind of like that. like that uh, feeling. If, you, if you've got a really short draw length at 25 inches, that's uh, not a bad gig. Let's go head over to the chronograph, see how fast it's shooting at the 25 inches, and then uh, show you guys the stats on this Axis Alpha. All right, now time to shoot it through the chronograph. We are set up at 70 pounds, 25 inch draw length. Um, so we're gonna see how fast it can be shooting with a 437 grain arrow at a very short draw. First shot is 251. Let's go with the second shot and check the consistency. So very consistent there at 250 FPS at 70 pounds um, with a 25 inch draw, 437 grain arrow. Um, not too bad for having such a short draw on that bow. Um, string angle, like I said, feels really good. It's it's a lot wider than what it is obviously at 30 inches being a short axle axle bow. Um, but yeah, that's kind of my thoughts honestly. I need to put it up against maybe like the black one at 25 or VXR28 and kind of see the differences there. But uh, yeah, great shooting bow there. That's kind of my thoughts on that. All right, that's gonna wrap up this video with a 25 inch draw on the Hoyt Axis Alpha. Um, I would definitely recommend getting this bow if you've got a short draw, um, 70 pounds, 25 inch draw. It just feels really comfortable. That string angle's a lot wider than uh, than I would have expected. Um, but yeah, that's gonna wrap this video up. Just wanna say thank you guys to all your support on my channel. Really, really appreciate it. If you haven't already subscribed to my channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Big thanks to Terry here at Team T Archery letting me come on in and shoot the bows. If you're ever in town in St. George, come on into the shop and come say hello, come test out some bows and equipment. And just wanna say thank you guys and we'll see you guys next time.